What's going down, Molly Skyler fans? Welcome back to Skyler Nation. Mom and woman versus food. Eating like a girl, cleaning my plate, wasting food is rude. Back at you with another subscriber challenge. This time it's from Roger from the Hot Dang Show. Rock on, dude. This is gonna be a spice challenge. I don't do a whole heck of a lot of these. I've been doing a lot more just because of the fact that, I don't know, actually I don't really mind them usually. Uh, that's not gonna mean that I will not ever be affected or go down in flames and start crying. That doesn't mean anything. Anyway, challenge this. He sent me chocolate bars. This is the bites challenge. Here's the box right there. Nothing huge for whatever, but I mean, it's so there's three bites in each box. I have two boxes here, two. Um, he didn't clarify if I want if he wanted me to do two boxes in the challenge or one. So let's see, there's some here too. No, there's not. Anyway, there are three chocolate bars. Pretty thicker swag. You have the purple, that one, and that one. Carolina Reaper. I don't know. So <laughs> okay, so the purple one is okay. This is gonna be the habanero. This one is ghost pepper. This one is Carolina Reaper. For skull, skull ratings, this was one, three, and five. So challenge for this one is you get two minutes to eat for each one of them and you get a five minute afterburn. So eat this one, start two minutes, eat that one, start two minutes, eat that one, five minute afterburn. So we'll see what happens with these. Um, I do like chocolate a lot, but you know, <laughs> Every time you get a different product, you nearly never know what you're gonna get. So this one right here, this is the habanero. Looks like, it kinda looks like a peanut butter or whatnot. So I'm gonna start, I'm gonna eat this. I'll start my two minutes. Roger, rock on, hot dang show. Check that out. If you're looking for hot stuff, you end up meeting Nemesis. He is the one that'll make you cry. I don't know how I feel about this. I do like hot stuff, we'll see. All right, once again, this one, will be the habanero. Let's see what happens. We can definitely taste it. Mm. Yeah, that You can see that you now start my time I guess so two minutes on that one this is a peanut butter with a chocolate with peanut butter and toffee dips um, milk chocolate habanero the first one was milk chocolate the second one is gonna be a white chocolate ghost pepper and the third one is dark chocolate Carolina Reaper now this is spicy I can feel it that is it is not a You can taste the spice in this. Um, I would not consider it a not spicy chocolate. I can taste it. I, I'm like, oof. Definitely getting me in the back of the throat. It's, I don't know if I'd want to eat 110 of these. Obviously, I know this one's going to be worse. But like I said, I've got to wait two minutes before I can even try this one. This one right here, white chocolate, peanut butter, coffee bits and whatnot. <laughs> The taste of the chocolate is very good, however, um, when compared to a, a Reese's cup at all, but <laughs> I can definitely feel the burn in my throat. I can feel the burn on my tongue, the upper part of my mouth. So we've got that. Like I said, next one is the white chocolate ghost pepper, hot bites. Uh, I'm not gonna do actually both boxes. I think I wanna actually share it because I have a coworker who loves this kind of stuff. So we'll see what happens with that. What am I at here? Minute 26. Whew. I guarantee after the second or third row, I am gonna be sweating because I can I can feel it. I can definitely feel this one. I'm just like, oh my God. This guy may actually make me cry. The thing about hot stuff is actually, once you start eating it, even though it might not be overwhelming per se, 
I almost end up like not being able to talk correctly. And uh, I don't know. It like gets to the point where it almost like numbs you inside your mouth. So, all right. Two minutes right there. Let me stop that. We'll clear that. Now we'll start with the next one. Like I said, this is the white chocolate ghost pepper. Eek. All right, two minutes on that. If I were to be, yeah, that one I thought was ahead. It unless it starts coming on here in a couple seconds, I feel like this one had less heat than the last one. And I don't know, maybe it's because it was white chocolate. I do feel a burn. It is hot. It's not, I'm, I will not, I'm not underestimating any of these things. But there is a burn kind of creeping in my mouth now. It was getting to the back of my throat. Um, I do feel, it's, I feel sweat down here and up here right now. So it's kind of like how my face is starting to sweat. It is spicy. Um, I don't know. It is, I'm, I don't know. I don't know how I feel right now. I just don't. <laughs> um, this is going to be the third one. Let me get this ready here. This is going to be the Dark Chocolate Carolina Reaper Bar. This is the black one. Like I said, black and third. And supposedly that is like... Okay. So the first one I had one skull. That was the purple one. The, th the second one I did was the red one. That had three. This one has six. So I'm assuming... Ugh. That is going to be way worse just because of the fact that it has six skulls on it. And, uh, I mean, six means worse, right? <laughs> uh, I also have to work later today, so hopefully I do not have any, uh, <laughs> burning issues later. We'll see what happens with that. Oh my god. A couple more seconds here and we'll start that last one. Definitely a hot chocolate bar. Um... Like I said, I, I really do feel like the other one was a little bit hotter, but maybe it's the chocolate. I don't know. Five, four, three, two, one. Two minutes. All right. Clear that off. So this one is supposed to be obviously way worse than the other ones. Carolina Reaper. Let's do this. I'll have a five minute afterburn after I finish this one. So let's see what happens. Hopefully I don't die. But it's supposed to be spicy. Thank you, Roger. This is the third one, and we will see what happens. I don't really like dark chocolate, by the way, but the kids like it. Maybe because it doesn't melt as fast. Oh. Yeah, but it actually tastes a lot better with this one. Five minutes. I don't know. 
I honestly feel like the first box was, or the first bar was the worst one. Um, you know what? I was gonna save this, but I'll just do it now. Cause I'll do it while I'm waiting on my afterburn for my first one. <laughs> yeah, might as well, right? All right, so purple one first again. I'm just gonna do these back to back to back just because whatever. I'm waiting on a five minute afterburn, so I might as well make myself useful. Once again, the habanero one. This one is the one I thought was the worst. I don't, I don't know. Maybe it's just me. Oh, whatever. Cute little boxes too. Mm -hmm. I have a cycle in my house. White chocolate. I just don't feel like this one was quite as hot. I think the purple one for me is the worst one. I don't know. Mm. Right, and here's that one right there. Carolina Reaper, let's go back at this one. Oh no, Roger. I actually like this card really. I like the picture of the dude on the back. <laughs> Nemesis, this is freaking awesome. Um, the chocolate, really. I mean, it's good chocolate. It really is. Uh, I hate to say that I would say the habanero, for some reason, seems to be hitting me harder than the other two. Um, I'm not really getting the effect of the Carolina Reaper or the Ghost. I mean, I know they're definitely hot, but the way that their heat is coming out of the chocolate for me, I honestly have to say that the Habanero was the worst one, and I don't know why. I, I can't under I can't honestly explain that. Um this is not overkill for me. They are definitely spicy. This is definitely not an easy challenge. But it's maybe not hitting me as hard as some people. I I don't know. But like I said I would definitely say for me, it's like I would say the the habanero seems to be the worst challenge or worst bar of all of them and i don't know maybe it's the way it's coming out the chocolate um it definitely has my nose running a little bit but i mean overwhelmingly in my mouth i don't really have a whole heck of a lot going on right there um let me see five minutes right there all right all right guys i guess 
Let's see, uh, the hot dang show, the bites challenge. I did both boxes. I did the other box while I was doing the afterburn on the other one because I really wasn't hitting it very much and it did, or it wasn't hitting me very much. And I was like, well, yeah, I don't know. So thank you, Roger. I do appreciate it. Nemesis. Sorry, dude. It really didn't get me. I don't know. I really do appreciate you all sending me the chocolate. It was delicious. It did have an awesome kick. I mean, really, I mean, it, it, it was just the taste of it was phenomenal. So I really do appreciate it. Watch the hot dang show. Look for that little, little doodad right there. If y'all want to order some chocolate, definitely get some of this stuff for sale. Definitely awesome. Definitely worth it. And I do appreciate all the likes here and all the subscriptions. So if you kindly want to, like and subscribe. If you're looking for more heat challenges, let me know. I'm more than willing to, to do anything you want if you're willing to send it my way. So I do love people who are uh, the subscriber challenges. You want to sponsor something? Let's do it. So... Yeah, I guess I'm gonna go to work here. <laughs> Molly Skyler, Mom and Woman versus Food. Literally taking on just about every single kind of food challenge at this point. Let me know what you wanna see. Thanks for watching, like and subscribe. We will check you next time. And thank you once again, Roger and Nemesis from the Hot Dang Show. Appreciate it.